In this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to use group hierarchies in the Buddy Boss platform. So to get here, you're going to go to settings, groups, and enable group hierarchies so that groups can have subgroups. Okay, so now we have our groups directory. And let's go ahead and make Coffee Addicts a subgroup of sports players. And I'll also make Architecture a subgroup of it as well, so we can see some hierarchies. So here we have Coffee Addicts. I'm gonna click Manage. And I'll go to Settings. And we have a new option for a parent group. So I'm gonna click Sports Players and make it the parent group. And let's manage this one as well. And again, I'm going to select sports players as its parent group. The reason it's the only option that's available is because it's actually the only other group that I'm a member of. So now we can see that breadcrumbs have been added and it shows sports players as the parent group to this one. And then if I click sports players, we can go to subgroups and you can see those two are the subgroups of it. So this is really useful for organizing your groups. Like as an example, this might represent a specific university and these might represent departments within that university, or maybe this is a company and this represents divisions within that company. Whatever you wanna do, it's very easy to do this now. And then you see one more option to restrict invitations. Restrict subgroup invitations to members of the parent group. Members must first be a member of the parent group prior to being invited to a subgroup. So that means here you could not invite somebody into the Coffee Addicts group unless that user is already a member of the Sports Players group. So to use the example of this is a university and these are departments within the university, you wouldn't want to invite someone else in the network into that department if they're not already a member of the university itself, possibly. If that's how you want it, then you can check this box restricted that way and it'll work that way throughout the site. In the past, in BuddyPress, this was the only way to do it was to use this plugin which hasn't been updated in five years and doesn't exactly work right. So that's why we built this as a default setting within BuddyBoss platform because on client projects, this would come up all the time and there wasn't ever a good option. So when we forked BuddyPress and modified it, we decided we would build in group hierarchy as a default option that everyone can use with just a checkbox.